I'm going to create a PowerPoint template that I can reuse and share with my colleagues. To start, I open PowerPoint and begin with a blank title slide. I'll begin by adding the content to my template, such as the title, my name, and the name of the class. Let's add a few more slides. On the Home tab in the Slides group, click New Slide, and then select the slide layout entitled Title and Content. In this layout, there are two content placeholders, one for a title and one for the body of content, such as text, a table, chart, smart art graphic, picture, clip art, or audio or video file. The title of this slide is Spacecraft Structures. Next, I will add a picture of a spacecraft to the body content placeholder. I'll use this free clip art image from Office Online. I'll add one more slide with a different layout. This one is called Two Content. I'll add the title now, and I'll come back later to add the bullet points and art for this slide. For the purposes of this demo, I'll move on to the next step, which is selecting a theme. Let's go back to the title slide. I'm going to pick a theme that I can apply to all of my slides. On the Design tab, in the Themes group, click the down arrow so that you can view the gallery of themes. I like this theme called Moonlight. I actually downloaded the Moonlight theme for free from Office Online earlier, so now it is available from my local theme gallery in PowerPoint. It looks all right, but I'd like to change the colors and fonts. To change the color scheme, on the Design tab, in the Themes group, I click Colors. Let's see if one of these custom or built-in color schemes will work. I like the shade of blue in the Metro color scheme. Now, let's change the fonts. Still in the Themes group, click Fonts. Oreo looks good to me. If you want to add an image, such as your logo, or some text to appear on every slide in the presentation, you need to go to Slide Master View to do that. On the View tab, click Slide Master. In the Slide Thumbnail pane, Select the Slide Master and then add your image. Some slide layouts, like this one, are by default set so that images do not display when you add them to the Slide Master. However, you can change that. On the Slide Master tab, in the Background group, uncheck the Hide Background Graphics checkbox. I want to save this presentation as a template, a .potx file, because I'll want to use it again. On the Microsoft Office button, click Save. In the Save as Type dropdown, choose PowerPoint Template. PowerPoint will automatically save your template to the Default Templates folder. And the next time I want to use this template, all I need to do is click the Microsoft Office button, click New, select My Templates, and then select my newly created template. 